5 in the morning of uh, Friday, I just realized it was Friday 13th, Friday, Friday the 13th, 2012, yeah, you know, if that means anything to you, hey, have a great day, otherwise, uh, I'm just finishing up the day, this is uh, uh, the end of uh, this period now, uh, I finished uploading uh, Big Bang, the last episode of Big Bang Theory RL, and that's going, uh, it's gone out. I pushed it out onto the social networks. I'll do some more later on tonight. Uh, but right now, things are heating up. Uh, the day is getting warm. And it's time for me to turn off all my lights. So, <laughs> uh, there's not much going to be happening over the next few hours. Till uh, maybe 8 o'clock, maybe, uh, you know, a little before then. Uh, I plan to go food shopping today, so... Uh, the rest of the vlog might be a little later. Anyway, I just thought I'd let you know that. Um, I'm supposed to have an awesome, awesome thing of the day, but because I'm trying to sort of do the Cassandra thing, the, the Nerds RL, and do something like that. But the problem is, is that uh, because I don't have a standard day, there's no way to have an awesome thing of the day. I, mean, I think for me, Awesome occurs all the time. Um, like getting the Linux Music Studio going, getting into that, that's an that, that's awesome thing. Getting a new hard drive for the computer. Ugh, getting a new hard drive for the computer on, 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 uh, back there for the, uh, for the electronics lab. That's an awesome thing. Uh, the friends I have on YouTube, that's an awesome thing. So, I think awesome things happen to me. Uh, daily do happen on a daily basis. It's just that uh, uh, I don't know exactly how to number them or pick out the one that was the awesome thing of the day. So uh, specifically, since I don't have a day. Anyway, just thought I'd share that with you before I go off to uh, uh, to sleep and uh, shut down for a bit. A computers are going to be on, but uh, I'm going to be out. <laughs> All right, take it easy. Well, it's getting near the end of the day now, uh, for myself anyways, what I call my day. Yeah, it's 6 o'clock in the morning, 6 hours and, six, yeah, it's 6 hours into the day of uh, Saturday, July 14th. Uh, I went food shopping earlier, uh, then uh, got here, spent an enormous amount of time cooling the place off, it had gotten very hot up here. Uh, hot here, in, in here, uh, yeah. Uh, what had happened is, and what had happened is that one of the, uh, cooling units in my place has, uh, stopped working, so I have to replace that, uh, sometime later today. Uh, probably go out and get a new cooling unit, and pull the old one out, put the new one in. And we got back, back working again. Other than that, uh, everything's okay. It's, it's uh, just about 85 degrees in here. Not that bad. Uh, with the other the other cooling fans in here, it, it seems things it seems to be okay. Uh, I'm able to control the humidity and everything, so it's not that bad. Um, what else is there? Um, yeah, but just working working away bit by bit. Um, it's mostly note taking today and reorganizing how I'm doing the studios. Because uh, after you do all the work, and then after you've done all the work, you've got all these notes all over the place, and you have to sort of organize your notes. And that's what I'm doing now is organizing my notes. Uh, and I didn't realize it's Friday already again, so 
Uh, that means we're going to go do another round of cleaning. Yeah, every weekend there's another round of cleaning. You do as much cleaning as you possibly can do. And, you know, we'll see where that, that takes us. So, yeah, uh, in terms of the, uh, the, uh, the, um, the uh, KDE desktop and sort of the, my, my uh, Kabanto experience, uh, right now I have uh, a wiki note system. Uh, the wiki notes that I have, it's actually crap, but the, the problem. Uh, I was using a standard note system, and then my notes started getting very large and needing, needing some way to sort of organize them better. And I looked at uh, things like Open Office and uh, Word do things, and I tried it for a bit. It didn't really work out too well. Uh, then I came across oh, me, this wiki note system, and it really allowed me to pull uh, pull in a lot of my notes that I had all together, organize them. But it, it, the program itself doesn't take up a lot of space on the desktop. In other words. Um, in terms of its overhead, it uses less than a third of the overhead of the, for the system uh, that uh, OpenOffice does for any of the word, you know, the word processing program. Uh, and yet, at the same time, uh, you can balance uh, the wiki nodes across the uh, across your network, so you don't have to actually have it just sort of sitting on one system. You can have it sort of spread out all over the place. And that way you can balance your, you know, what you're doing out. So that's where things are right now. I'm doing work in that. Um, I found, because uh, uh, I'm, I'm on Twitter, and I, 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 do, I have a number of Twitter accounts. Uh, I found that the best Twitter program uh, was Chaku. But I don't use the one in uh, the repository. What I always do is I always go to the uh, web page itself, see what the latest one is, and install it from the dev file. From the dev file. So I basically download the dev file and then install it from there. Um, that I found in terms of it uh, functioning, uh, I found that's the best way to handle uh, handle handle it. I tried Gwibber and a couple other different. Uh, uh, Twitter platforms on uh, uh, programs on um, on Ubuntu and Ubuntu, and I don't none of them really seem to work that well. Uh, the one that seems to work the work work the best for me is uh, Chaku, and so I'm sticking with that. Uh, what else is there? Not much else. Today today has actually been kind of a slow day. Not much would actually actually happen, so there's not really much to talk about. Anyway, uh, I will leave it here, uh, and uh, this at some point in time will go up, to, uh, probably in an hour or so, half hour. This will go to the edit editor and then up to uh, YouTube. Alrighty, see you in the next episode. That will be in a couple hours. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, six o'clock. Well, six thirty in the morning. Yeah, six thirty. Six hours and 30 minutes into the day of Sunday, July 15th. Uh, we're doing another uh, long day, long day. Uh, Silly to do the way things have been going. Um, uh, well, I've been so much keeps catching up from my sleep. Uh, things have been popping up that I've had to get up in between. Uh, one of the things that I've worked on uh, over the weekend is uh, one of the parts of the cooling system um, sort of went out. So I had to replace that, did that today, did most of the replacement today. Uh, it does take a day to replace things because you, if you get the part around noon uh, that had to be replaced, but I couldn't do the install until around 6, 7 o'clock after I pulled the place off, so it took me uh, a, a while to really uh, 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 sort of pull the old part out, put the new part in, get everything sort of fixed up and squared away and uh, that's where we are today, where I am right now. Uh, I also added in uh, some of the new equipment I was going to get yesterday, uh, or yeah, yesterday, and uh, did that, and what, and what they are are the, uh, they're the LED lights that uh, plug into a USB port 
and they're good if you want to turn all the lights off because it's hot in the wherever you're working and but you need to see the keyboard then that's not a problem because you have these LED lights here and so I put them on all the all the points where I go and work uh, they're all on there and um, they work very well I can uh, turn the lights off and I can work no problem in the dark so yay for that um, Uh, anything on Linux right now? Not, nothing much. I said today, uh, the weekend has been more or less uh, sort of a reorganized or organization type of thing, uh, and, and I'm working on my notes, reorganizing my notes. Uh, it is, but what should be, uh, and I've said this before, what should be noted is that uh, this is a working Linux uh, production environment. That's a, this is sort of or, 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 I'm sorry. This is. Linux is the main platform here. There's nothing else but Linux uh, on the systems. So uh, as I do my work, my notes, whatever, that's all within Linux. So Linux is uh, uh, a, a standard part uh, of the environment. So uh, whether it's the graphic overlays or whatever, and this is sort of the thing I wanted to sort of bring up is that uh, uh, the graphic overlays is a mix between Caden Live and uh, uh, GIMP, so yay, and I'm going to try to do uh, other things as well to, uh, to sort of push the uh, envelope further and see how much, how much further I can get into uh, uh, production environment with, with Linux, so uh, that's about it for now, I'm going to leave it short uh, because I've got other, other work to do now, uh, and I might try to vlog later on today, I'm going to a Greek wedding uh, in my family, so uh, I'll try to do some uh, vlogging there, and that way you guys will see some of the uh, uh, my big fat Greek wedding. It's, it, this is part of my my culture, part of my life. So okay, why not? Anyway, uh, I'll let you go for now, and I've got to go do some other work here, and maybe see you in a bit. I don't know. Alrighty, it's uh, Thursday, July 17th, and it's uh, one hour and 13 minutes into the day, or one thirteen in the uh, 13 in the morning, yeah. Uh, it may seem like it's been a while since I've vlogged and that this vlog isn't continuous, but it is. Uh, the problem is, the last few, two days, uh, I've had a technical problem with uh, the cooling system where uh, the... Uh, primary cooling unit, the AC unit that, that, that feeds the whole system, uh, uh, died, it, it crapped out, and I had to uh, replace the whole thing, so I've been in the dark here for uh, a couple of days, because uh, keeping the lights off keeps the temperature down, uh, but the new one is in place, it's installed, it's working, uh, I ran the test today to see uh, um, with the lights off, uh, what happens with the temperature in terms of the high and low. Uh, if you know um, anything about uh, temperature, and you, this is something you may not, not have realized, is that every there are two points in the day. There's a high point in, the tem in terms of the temperature and a low point in terms of the temperature. Low point, the low uh, of the temperature usually occurs around 5 o'clock in the morning, and the high occurs around 5 o'clock in the evening. Uh, and so I tested it out to see, I wanted to see how high the temperature got by 5 o'clock. That that's your peak temperature. And um, it peaked out at uh, 81 degrees, uh, relatively low humidity in here. Uh, so it was very comfortable, we could sleep, no problem. Uh, I've got um, these new um, uh, LED lights, the uh, USB LED lights, so I can work in the dark, that's not a problem. And I was actually working in the dark, but I can't film in the dark. I can't uh, do the vlogging in the dark. So uh, that's what that's what sort of uh, stopped the uh, vlogging was uh, it was too dark to film. So uh, that was the whole the whole spiel. So, but anyways, uh, it's uh, back to the usual schedule. We're now working again on the usual schedule. So things will start chugging along. And I'll give a shout out to Mr. Mumpus. Don't worry, I know it's hard. 
when you're young to wait weeks for things that you want now. But uh, the squishies are being worked on. I'm working on a, a, a special project for Mr. Muppets. And, you know, it's, it's hard when you're young to, uh, to wait weeks for something that you want right now. And I just want to let her know that uh, I am working on it. Things are working out. But is it, this is a process that will take weeks. It's not a, a short process. Uh, and and um, uh, mid-August, we should be uh, moving along pretty well. All right, so that's it for this segment here. Uh, we're going to continue on. This, this is going to be one long vlog day again. Uh, you've noticed that the, there's been no breaks in the long one, one long vlog. Uh, vlog. Uh, and I am getting tired. I'm getting sort of exhausted from this. From this, uh, the, the work, the pit, the, the, pit, the uh, work pace. Uh, so, but uh, I'll be back maybe in a couple hours to uh, do the final vlog of the day and uh, then send this up to the internet to uh, to the say, uh, no, sir. I just send it to the uh, video editor, render it, and then up. All right, take it easy. All right, it's five o'clock in the morning. Yeah, five hours in. Uh, yeah, five hours is the day of uh, Tuesday, July 17th, 2012. And we're continuing on. Uh, I had a brief power outage here uh, uh, just about uh, an hour ago, an hour and a half ago. Uh, reset everything up. The power outage every time uh, it reveals different problems in uh, uh, a, a network on well, my computer system. Every time I have to reboot something, uh, if it goes out cold, uh, then it restarts, and the configuration is different from what was from what from what it was last time. Uh, I found that um, for some reason the configuration, even though you've rebooted it several times, uh, when you do a cold reboot, it, there's a sort of a, a reconfiguration uh, of the system. Uh, I don't know exactly why that is. I'm going to sort of look and see what's going on in terms of uh, how things work for the reboots. But uh, it kind of brought me in and started look, had me look around a little more at Pulse Audio because I was having some issues with Pulse Audio. And uh, the, the issues that popped up, the issue that popped up uh, was one that Pulse Audio was missing the component I didn't have on here for some uh, somehow it got deleted uh, the pulse audio control so when I loaded the pulse audio control and went in to see what was going on I realized that pulse audio in the uh, was not only listing the local sound card but was listing all the sound cards across the network and for some reason uh, the system really can't figure out what's the local card and what's the not local card. So what I did is I clicked and turned off the um, uh, the network component of Pulse Audio so you can't, Pulse Audio can't see the cards on the other network, uh, across the network. Uh, and reboot it. When I did that, a large chunk of the sound card that had been missing before came back. And so that sort of let me know that Pulse Audio uh, Although it's supposed to be a networkable, uh, a networkable uh, sound system, really is there's a lot of bugs in there. So, is because I'm not really using the network components of Pulse Audio that much, don't really require them uh, as of yet. Uh, what I've done is I've gone in and disabled the network section uh, of Pulse Audio. And that seems to resolve a number of the issues that I was having before. So, uh, but I think I'm not going to be working on uh, the Linux Music Studio on this uh, station here uh, for the next few weeks. Uh, I'm going out on research, so uh, right now I have to shelve the uh, Linux Music Studio uh, here for now for the next two, three weeks. And then when I come back in two, three weeks, uh, I'm going to be vlogging while I'm, while, while, while I'm out doing the research, so you'll be able to see that. But it's not going to be uploaded until after I come back. So there's going to be about two weeks where uh, there are no vlogs going to go up. 
about the walk they're being done and you will see them sequentially as I come back. So, uh, yeah, onward and upward, uh, getting ready for the science expeditions uh, on Wednesday. I'm going to start moving out to, do, to doing the science expeditions. This is research in the field. Uh, it keeps me outside a long, for long hours, uh, so I'm not really going to be in the office, and the ability to upload is going to be very minimal. So I decided to sort of shelve any of the uploads in the vlog, uh, in terms of uh, uploading the vlog for that period. And then when I come back, typically after August 6th, uh, then the uploads will start again on a more regular basis. So, yeah. Uh, I hope everyone's having a good summer so far. Uh, my cooling system seems to be working very well. So, uh, onwards and upwards then. I will see you people. Yeah, probably tomorrow night. I'll probably do one more, one more vlog. This is, I don't have until Wednesday. And then, it's two weeks. I'll see you guys in two weeks after that. Alright, take it easy. Professor of what? Professor of physics. Free speech rules here at Democratic Earth.